Hey traders, mark it up day time, let's get straight into it. Do not place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video. Trading is risky and it can cause substantial financial loss. There is no guarantees of making money in the markets. And trading is the most hardest thing you'll ever do and it takes a long time to become a good trader. So this video is just educational only. If you're struggling with your trading right now, then click on the very first link in the description and get a free training, the seven universal laws to become a master trader that will boost your success, consistency, and confidence without spending a decade trying to figure it out. Click on the very first link in the description right now. All right, hey traders, want to do a quick market update for you. Um, just a quick, quick one around the around the sort of the uh, what's really happening through here on the on the silver and gold chart. We're about to we are about to take off. I believe it's like. What a sideways sort of very, 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 very slow sort of sideways movement through here. So we actually can see that. What do we have through here? We have all this through here. We have this all this resistance on this support, 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 holding it up. But then also what do we have down through here? We have like this, this sort of resistance down through here as well too, right? You can see how it's just really into this triangle pattern. So where is it going to break? Nobody knows, but I do believe up. But man, let's see what actually happens with that there. And the same with gold chart as well too. Now the gold chart to me, I believe is going to be up. Again, that big bull flag is holding there. I believe we're likely to start to race up and we're likely to start to take off to the upside. Gold is definitely holding up a lot stronger than than the other indices, uh, the other than, than silver. Looking onto the Dow Jones, the Dow Jones actually broke out of this apex right now, or this triangle pattern, and broke out to the downside. I still say that there's something lurking behind the scenes that's going to see this market through the floor uh, very, very shortly. And the reason why is once again is that this Dow Jones, if I take this off the screen and say bring up say a three month chart, you can see the Dow Jones once again is now making a significant lower high where the S&P 500 made a significant higher high. That is spelling tr big, big, big trouble. When they start to decapulate, decapulate, is that the right word? Um, pull apart from each other then um, that's basically what we um that's basically what we are uh, um yeah so pull apart from each other that's basically telling me that we're likely to get a lot more downside to come nasdaq is not really falling in suit at all we're just really just having a little down day uh through there but that nas that dow jones once again is telling me definitely telling me definitely telling me that um that especially if we start to break this significant low through here, I would definitely, definitely, definitely start to be worried about uh, a lot more downside to come. So it's going to be really interesting to see what actually happens through here. A lot more, to me, I believe there's a lot more downside to come out of this one here. Silver and gold look like they're poised to move, move up and the stock market is getting very top heavy. It looks like it's going to move down. What do you guys think?